MJF is a neutral witness to the backstage altercation that occurred at AEW All Out. Bobby Fish had some unfavorable things to say about CM Punk, including that his martial arts is insulting the audience's intelligence. Happy Friday, everyone. It's Denise Salcedo. You're watching the latest, and we got some more news for you regarding the backstage altercation that took place at AEW All Out. Maxwell Jacob Friedman is believed to have seen everything as it happened. Regarding the backstage altercation between CM Punk, A Steel, and the Elite at AEW All Out, our own Dave Meltzer reported it in Friday's edition of the Wrestling Observer Newsletter that AEW has hired an independent firm to investigate the matter. The firm will be conducting interviews with CM Punk, A Steel, Pat Buck, The Young Bucks, Kenny Omega, Christopher Daniels, Michael Nakazawa, and Brandon Cutler. Additionally, MJ. MJF is one of a number of neutral parties who will also be interviewed. MJF had recently returned to AEW after a three-month absence at All Out. While under a mask, he won the casino ladder match earlier in the show before unmasking after Punk's victory over Jon Moxley in the main event. And Bobby Fish had a lot of unfavorable things to say about CM Punk. Take a look. During an interview with NBC Sports Boston released on Friday, Bobby Fish discussed his match with Punk from the October 27, 2021 edition of Dynamite. The finish of the match saw Fish appear to kick out of Punk's GTS just as the referee was counting three. Punk was declared the winner regardless. Bobby Fish had this to say, Phil is not a bad pro wrestler, but what Phil is is not a martial artist. I've been doing martial arts since I was eight years old, so I take a lot of pride in it. He is a pro wrestler, so go out, tackle, drop down, leapfrog, get it again, all that stuff. All good. In that lane, dare I say he's got talent, but when it comes to martial arts, you are insulting the audience's intelligence because we are all supposed to be creating an atmosphere where you can suspend your disbelief. Bobby Fish continued to say that selling for Punk's more MMA-inspired offense was insulting to him. Fish continued to say that CM Punk was not happy with him after their match. Phil after the match was a Frankly, as a martial artist, I went out and I laid my shoulders down for you. You should be grateful I did because on national TV, if I decided that I wanted to f***ing haku your ass, I could have because you're that little bit of a threat in my world. I'm not John Jones or Anderson Silva, but I've been doing martial arts since I was young and I can handle myself enough to where I will fold you like a wet nap, Phil Brooks. So for you to be Afterwards, because of a mistake that you made, it just doesn't wear well. Fish went on to criticize Punk for using the GTS as his finisher, a move that was first used by Kenta, saying, quote, not to mention the move that he finished me with is not even his finish, it was Kenta's, which anybody who knows pro wrestling knows that's kind of f***ed up and you weren't even decent enough to change the name. Bobby Fish was also asked about CM Punk's comments at the AEW All Out Media Scrum. He said, quote, I think Phil kind of showed the world the scumbag he can be. Maybe he's not that scumbag every day, but I guess we all got a little bit of scumbag in us. And some of us do a better job of controlling it than others. On his podcast earlier this week, Bobby Fish invited CM Punk to face him in a boxing, kickboxing, or MMA fight. Well, there was a lot to unpack there. What are your thoughts on this story? Go ahead and let us know in the comments section below. As always, do not forget to give this video a like, subscribe to F4W online. And if you would like to chat pro wrestling with me, feel free to follow me on Twitter and or on Instagram at underscore Denise Salcedo. And I'll catch you on Speak Now Pro Wrestling, which airs here on F4W online Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Fridays.